everyone and welcome back to the channel. Hello! So today we're filming a day in the life vlog, a cosy at home lockdown 3.0 vlog <laughs> um, and we thought we would just show you what we get up to um, in a lockdown day at home. I don't know why I'm standing like Superman. I am ready for the day in the life vlog. <laughs> um, so we've just got up, oh no, we got up a while ago actually, um, showered and we got all ready for the day. Mm. I have on my new top from Joni, which I got for Christmas, with a cute little slinky dog on it. Slinky dog. How cute. I love it so much. It's really comfortable as well. Um, yes, oh, and I also have my necklace on from Martin, from Anna Luisa. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm, yeah. wearing, I'm wearing Christmas socks. Are you? Yeah. <laughs> Let's have a look. <laughs> no, don't show the Christmas socks. Show them. No. Go on. I know Christmas they is gone. They look red. They look red. You've seen them before. It's the Kermit ones. Kermit. But this is because we're a bit behind. On, on the washing. Old, on the old washing. So today's going to be full of jobs like washing, <laughs> um, but also we probably have a few little fun things planned um, you can do at home as well. Um, we're just taking each day as it comes at the moment, uh, but we're sending all our love to everyone. Hope you're all doing okay. And yeah, we're going to think of some fun video ideas um, for throughout lockdown. Um, we... Tell us also please that I'm not doing a makeup today. <laughs> I was just about to say we filmed the fiance does my makeup and if you want to laugh and you haven't seen it go and watch it um it was so funny <laughs> I it was funnier doing... than I thought it would be I enjoyed doing that type of video actually it was nice yeah. to be like a bit of a challenge if you have any other fun challenge videos pop them in the comments we never really did challenge videos before yeah. um, but they are actually quite fun to film there is the one that I've seen where uh not my hands Oh, okay. But then, but then you have to think of something to do. To do. Because the other videos I've seen people do that on is makeup, but makeup. We've, already, we've already done the makeup. Yeah, so. and I don't want to repeat that. <laughs> <laughs> also something that I did this morning. <laughs> I signed up to TikTok. So <laughs> I'm on there now. I really fancied doing some like lip syncs to some of my favourite TV shows, some of my favourite movies. Um, sort of being creative on there because of the short form videos. And yeah, so I'm on there, and my name on there, if you do want to search for me, is uh, martin.bell. So it's actually the same as my Instagram handle. But uh, all I've got up there at the moment is just a trailer for the Pirates of the Caribbean video that I did for the channel. But yeah, hoping to do some bits and pieces, and then I think you're hoping to do some as well, aren't you, on yeah, your channel? we should do some <laughs> funny videos over lockdown. Yeah. So we're just going to head out for a quick walk. Um, I've got my new coat on. Christmas coat, it's so warm and cozy. I love it. Um, so we're just gonna head out, do a little bit of exercise, have a little bit of a walk outside. We're not gonna bring the camera, um, but we'll be sure to catch up with you when we're back. So we just got back from our walk and it was cold. It was so cold. We we're wondering if it's gonna snow here. Um, I know that it snowed loads up north and in other places. Um, but yeah, it is really cold. <laughs> But we've got a fish finger sandwich and we're going to watch something as we eat. Um, we finished Modern Family. Yeah, we finished Modern Family yesterday. Season 11. I won't give away any spoilers, but we were so sad. Sad that it's ended. I really love that show. We're thinking that we'll probably go back and watch it from the beginning. Um, <laughs> because we loved it that much. But yeah, let us know if you've seen it. Um, we managed to find the last season on Now Entertainment. Um, so we just signed up for a free... Oh, was it free? Oh no, we signed up for a month and then we're going to cancel it. Um, just because we really wanted to watch it. If you're a new person to it though, there's a free seven day trial. Ah, that's good to it's know. It's Now TV and then it's the Now Entertainment. Pack. Yeah. But if you haven't watched Modern Family, highly recommend and it's perfect for lockdown. Um, the first few seasons are on Netflix and I think they're on Amazon, but I don't know if you have to pay for them on Amazon. But they're definitely on Netflix. But it's so good. But I think with our lunch, I'm going to pop on either Location, Location, Location or Love It or List It. Because that's another one of my guilty pleasures with Kirsty and Phil gonna put love it or list it on they got a new season in case anyone was wondering i've had to pop on my eeyore jumper because it is so cold 
Um, we have our radiators on, but I just, it's just so cold today, like outside. Um, so I think it's just, it's just a cold day. Um, so we've watched Love It or List It. I love that show. Um, and now we're going to use our slow cooker for the very first time. Oh yeah. So Martin's mum kindly gave us a slow cooker. Um, she gave it to us a few months ago, but we just haven't got round to using it. Was, it. When was it? it was, was it when, we, when we went up or was it before then? Yeah, no, probably even more than a few months ago. Quite a long time ago. <laughs> I think because we've been using Gusto and HelloFresh, we just haven't really used the slow cooker. But we wanted to give it a go today. We actually meant to start it earlier um, so that it went on all day. And, uh, and we're good. actually starting it quite late, but you can put it on high for four hours. We're gonna do a group watch on Disney Plus with Jess and Tom uh, tonight. So it is coming up, well it's just, it's half three now. So if we get it all in for four, it'll be ready by eight. So a little bit later than we wanted. Yeah. So we're just gonna make it as a chicken casserole from the BBC Good Food website. Um, but yeah, I'm excited actually. I've always wanted a slow cooker. So yeah, hopefully it will come out nice. So this is the one that we're gonna attempt, the slow cooker chicken casserole, BBC Good Food. Prep 10 minutes, cook four hours, 15 minutes. Easy, that's what we like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, it serves two adults and two children, so we should have some uh, leftovers. Yeah, we can have that tomorrow, can't we? Yeah. Uh, ingredients. So I'm just going to get all these prepared. I don't think we have all of them, but we've got all of the important bits. <laughs> So it's on now, this is where we see whether it works. So we got some snap peas, potatoes, carrots, chicken, chicken stock. Anything else? Did I miss anything? Um, yeah, sorry, I wasn't very good at filming and doing it. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, and we like covered the chicken in some flour. Yes. Mm -hmm. And we had to cook that in a pan first and then put it in. I'm excited. Is it all in there? It's all in there. Mm. So our casserole is cooking, I've put on a wash, Martin is doing a little bit of freelance work next to me here, <laughs> and I'm going to make him a coffee in his new coffee machine. I love it. <laughs> what mug do you want? Um, a small, like that Mickey Mouse one might be alright. I'm <laughs> having a pod. mouse party! <laughs> and then I think I'm going to have a tea in Chippendale! But does anybody else find that because it's so dark outside early, you start feeling tired earlier? <laughs> so apologies for the kessel, um, but this is the machine. A Dolce Nescafe Dolce Gusto. Uh, turn it on here. Oh, it's not plugged in. <laughs> Number one rule, <laughs> plug it in first. And check to see if you've got enough water. Oh, it's because the slow. I was about to un, um, unplug the slow oh, no, cooker no, then. Unplug the slow cooker. Unplug the kettle because it's done. So check there's enough water. Yep, yeah, there's enough water. Turn it on. Uh, wait till it goes green. And then I'm making a latte macchiato. So this actually takes two pods. First of all, is like the white milky one, and then the coffee. So it's turned green, but I've just got to double check. So on the pods, it tells you like how much um, to fill it. So that is two from the top. So you put it back in and then two from the top. So there, then you flick it over to hot. Woohoo, they're really good. This is like a mini me one. So it's very small, very compact. But it's just so easy. So I've just made myself a little pucker tea. Um, I got a pack of pucker teas um, and they had like different flavours in them so I could try out and see which ones I liked. And I actually like them all, they're really nice. Um, but this is the Feel New um, tea, which 
Oh, it smells really good. I can't remember what's in it now. I know fennel's in it and some other things. But yeah, I really like the Puckettees. Um, I like the nighttime one and I like their lemon and ginger one. They're really good. But I thought what I would quickly do is I asked on Instagram for some YouTube ideas of what people wanted to see, like over lockdown and then beyond. Um, but I specifically asked for videos that we could film whilst we're at home. Um, because of course, we would love to film Disney vlogs. Um, but obviously that's not gonna be for a little while. Um, so yeah, I was just seeing what, what people fancied watching uh, whilst we're at home. And so many people got back to me. Um, so thank you so much. I actually have filled out this page and this page with video ideas already. And um, so I've got a Disney page and then I've got a other page. Um, so I'm just gonna add everyone's ideas as well um, and then I should have quite a long list um, I just find it really helpful to have them all written down so that I can if I'm like thinking oh what should I film for this week they're all there and then if I have a wide selection I can choose what I feel like filming um, more so than like oh I have to film that because it's my only idea if I have loads then I can be like oh I actually like fancy filming that kind of thing and then I just tick them off as we go um but yeah let me I did take screenshots of them all yep I've got them all here so I'm gonna go through and add them to my little YouTube um book we use this Toy Story book and we've also got a Hercules one and we use them for like all of our YouTube planning um, So yeah, get a little bit organized and I thought that would be a lovely afternoon Task to do whilst watching a little bit of YouTube myself and having a little tea So a bit of time has passed. I've just popped on some comfy clothes because I'm gonna be doing my yoga. I've been doing 30 days of yoga. I haven't done 30 days yet. <laughs> I'm up to day, what day am I up to? Six or seven, which is pretty good. It's like a week of yoga every single day. Um, I do the Yoga with Adrian channel and her 30 day yoga challenge is called Breathe or Breath and it's all about the breath um, and I've been loving it. It's been so nice, especially during lockdown, to have something to focus on each day. Um, I've been doing them a little late. I think I would like to try and do them a little bit earlier when I wake up. Um, but I still have managed to get to the mat each day and to take part. So I'm up to day seven called Synchronize, 27 minutes. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do that now and then it probably, oh no, I'll probably have about half an hour and then our dinner will be ready. Um, but that's good because that will give um, my stomach a little bit of time to settle after the yoga. But yeah, it's really good. It's a really lovely mix of mindfulness, but also yoga that you can feel working for your body. Um, and yeah, I'd highly recommend it. She keeps the classes up on her YouTube channel, so you can take part at any time. You can start the challenge on any day. Um, so yeah, let me know if you're doing it. I know some people messaged me on Instagram um, because they saw that I was doing it and it inspired them to take part. So that's so cool. I hope you're enjoying it as well. And yeah, let me know if you take part and if you enjoy it, I would highly recommend. I'll pop it in the description box. So let's do some yoga. it and it was so good I can't explain how much it's improved my body and my mind um, just doing yoga every day for seven days um, hoping to complete the full 30 and then beyond <laughs> but even feeling the benefits from doing it for a week has been 
crazy. Like there are some days when I just don't want to get on the mat, but as soon as I'm on there and doing it, I realize how important it is. And then every single time I never regret it. So yeah, I'm so happy that I'm doing it. And yeah, just really enjoying it. Um, I'd love to do more yoga. Um, so I think this is like a great way to get back into it. I'm kind of a bit hit and miss with yoga. Like I'll do it for like a few months really solidly and then I won't do it for like three months and then I'll pick it back up again. Um, so I'm hoping that this is the start of doing it a lot more um, and doing it every day. Like mm. that would be, you know, every day from now on would be amazing. Um, but at least every day for the next 30 days is a definite. Um, so yeah, that's day seven complete. I've been doing a little tick off on my Instagram, which is probably annoying everyone, um, but I do it more for me. Um, it just kind of holds me accountable. So I'm going to do that now. Um, it's just like a little tick off where I'll just be like day seven complete. Um, so sorry if that's been annoying you. <laughs> Um, but I'm about to do it again. <laughs> so I've got my comfies on, I've got my dressing gown on, <laughs> and the casserole is ready. It's ready. Yum, yum, yum. So we're gonna enjoy this, and we're also gonna do a watch party with Jess and Tom, and watch the film Togo. So we just finished our group watch of Togo with Jess and Tom on Disney Plus and it was so good actually. I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot more than I thought I would. I didn't really know what to expect. I didn't realise it was based on a true story. Um, so we read up about them, didn't we? <laughs> yeah, it was recommended to us ages ago and uh, Peter said it was really good and I liked it. I really loved it. Yeah, yeah it was really, really good. Oh, my hair. <laughs> Boy, I've got my hair back like this. I tried to film a TikTok and I was too ambitious and it didn't go quite to plan. So I'm going to try again tomorrow, but <laughs> I changed my hair for it. <laughs> so Martin has TikTok now. I think he mentioned at the beginning of the vlog. Yeah. 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 Uh, but we'll pop it in the description box. Um, but yeah, so we just finished watching the group watch. I would highly recommend doing the group watch. Um, it just makes you feel more connected. And we also were like just WhatsApping as it was going on. It was loads of fun, so I've got a couple lined up for next week as well. Mm-hmm. Um, but now we're just watching Rick Stein's Cornball show, um, but we're watching it because my good friend Fia is on there. Um, her partner Gil owns a cheese business, and episode two is all about them and yeah. the cheese business. Um, so if you watch that show, <laughs> um, then that is my good friend Fia, you see her a couple of times, and also Gil as well. So yeah, we're just watching that, um, and then we'll probably head to bed. Mm -hmm. So we'll probably leave this vlog here, and <laughs> why are you laughing? <laughs> um, hope you enjoyed it, and we will see you on Tuesday for, oh, just in time because the battery's flashing. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you on Tuesday for a brand new video. Bye! Doodle Pipsky!